The Heart Center at Nationwide Children's is dedicated to the unique needs of its patients. One of the conditions the center supports is Tetralogy of Fallot. Tetralogy of Fallot is a heart defect made up of four heart problems. It results in cyanotic or blue babies. The four heart problems are ventricular septal defect, overriding aorta, pulmonary stenosis, and right ventricular hypertrophy. A ventricular septal defect is a hole in the wall between the two lower chambers of the heart called the ventricles. The hole allows oxygen-rich blood to mix with oxygen-poor blood. Normally, the aorta attaches to the left ventricle, which pumps oxygen-rich blood through it. In an overriding aorta, the aorta has moved forward directly over the hole between the ventricles. This allows oxygen-poor blood from the right ventricle to flow into the aorta. Pulmonary stenosis means that the blood vessel going to the lungs, called the pulmonary artery, is narrowed, and the pulmonary valve doesn't open all the way. As a result, less blood reaches the lungs. These heart problems cause the baby to be blue because the heart pumps less oxygen-rich blood to the body. Right ventricular hypertrophy means the wall of the right ventricle is thicker than normal. This happens because the right ventricle has to work harder to pump blood through the narrowed pulmonary valve. Treatment for Tetralogy of Fallot may include temporary and complete surgical repair procedures. Sometimes, a child is not ready for a complete repair right away. In this case, a temporary repair called a shunt can be placed until a complete repair can be done. The shunt improves oxygen levels in the blood. During this procedure, the surgeon will place a tube called a shunt between a branch of the aorta and the right pulmonary artery. The shunt will provide another path for blood to get to the lungs to pick up oxygen. Instead of a shunt, another temporary procedure can be done. In this procedure, a device called a stent is placed in the narrow area to allow more blood to flow to the lungs. Most patients have a complete repair at four to six months of age. If the main pulmonary artery is too small, it will be widened with a patch. If the pulmonary valve is too small, it may be widened with a patch called a transannular patch. If the narrowing is below the pulmonary valve, the surgeon will remove some of the heart muscle in this area. This improves the flow of oxygen-poor blood from the right ventricle to the lungs. To fix the ventricular septal defect, the surgeon will cover the hole with a patch. The patch prevents the mixing of oxygen-poor blood with oxygen-rich blood. As a result, only oxygen-rich blood flows out of the aorta to the body from the left ventricle. The Heart Center team at Nationwide Children's is dedicated to supporting your child. We are available to answer all of your questions at any time at 614-722-2530 and at nationwidechildrens.org slash heart.